Today our destination is Connaught Place, Jantar Mantar. It is in New Delhi, India. It is in the heart of the city, the Connaught Place, the main shopping centre and trading centre of New Delhi. The Jantar Mantar is located in the modern city of Delhi. It consists of 13 architectural astronomy instruments. Jantar stands for Yantra, it means instrument, and Mantar means formula. Actually, both these words are from Sanskrit language. The site is one of the five built by Maharaja Jaising II of Jaipur. From 1724 onwards, he was given by Mughal Emperor Muhammad Shah the task of revising the calendar and astronomical tables. There are four instruments with the observatory of Jantar Mantar in New Delhi. The Samrat Yantra, the Ram Yantra, the Jayaprakash Yantra and the Misra Yantra. The primary purpose of the observatory was to compile astronomical tables. And to predict the times and the movements of the sun, moon and planets. Some of these purposes nowadays would be classified as astronomy. The Misra Yantra was designed as a tool to determine the shortest and the longest days of the year. It could also be used to indicate the exact moment of the noon in various cities and locations regardless of their distance from Delhi. Quite remarkable. This is the main point of attraction in Jantar Mantar. The Mishra Yantra was able to indicate when it was known in the various cities all over the world and was the only structure in the observatory not invented by Jay Prakash II. My definition of beautiful is the nature and here you can view the beautiful scenery.
you can see the beauty of nature here very clearly. Beautiful wind blows. Look at the trees. The Misra or composite yantra is composed of five different instruments. The five component yantras are the Dakshin Uttra Piti, Samrat, Niyat Chakra, Karka Rasivalya, and Western Quadrant. There is a plaque fixed on one of the structure in the Jantar Mantar Observatory in New Delhi that was placed there in 1910, mistakenly dating the construction of the complex to the year 1710. So guys, this is a mistake over there. Later research though suggests 1724 as the actual year of construction.
रामयंज रामयंज द टू लार्ज सिलेंड्रिकल स्ट्रक्चर्स विथ ओपन टॉप यूज टू मेजर द एटीट्यूड ऑफ स्टार्स बेस्ड ऑन द लैटीट्यूड एंड द लॉन्गिट्यूड ऑन द अर्थ The Jay Prakash consists of hollowed out hemisphere with marking on the concave surface. Cross wires were stretched between points on the rim. These are the twin bowl of the Jay Prakash instrument at Delhi Jantar Mandir Observatory. The bowl are a reflection of the sky. Every point in the sky is reflected on to a point on the bowl through the center of the cross wire stretched on the surface of the bowl
Jai Prakash literally means light of Jin. Its function is to measure and coordinate azimuth and altitude of celestial object, local time and other zodiac observations. Samrat Yantra Samrat Yantra or the supreme instrument is a giant triangle that is basically an equal hour sundial. It is 70 feet high, 114 feet long at the base and 10 feet thick. It has 128 foot long hypotenuse that is parallel to the Earth's axis and points towards the North Pole. On either side of the triangle is a quadrant with graduations indicating hours, minutes and seconds. At the time of Samratian's construction, Sundial already existed, but the Samratian turned the basic sundial into a precision tool for measuring declination and other related coordinates of various heavenly bodies. Delhi is a beautiful city having many monuments and many shopping centers. The main point of attraction over here in Kunar Place is Jantar Mantar, 